Carl, what the hell are you doing here? I hear rumours of this elusive black marlin that roams the suburbs of East London. I've got my setup ready here with a live bait, and I'm just scoping out the surroundings. I want to see if I can find this thing here quickly. Apparently they make amazing chow, but hey, you're going to ruin my, my stealth mode here. Let me stalk this thing. Out of the black morning. Let's grab our tackle and go catch it. secret spot where the elusive marlin is normally hanging around and where it feeds. You can see signs of that it was here. We're just gonna wait and see as soon as we see that marlin we're gonna throw that bait in and we're gonna catch it and we're gonna feast like kings tonight during this lockdown while everyone's stressing. We're gonna have food like kings. Let's just wait here quietly. Oh yes, we've got the elusive black marlin on. And check it, it's taking stick. Oh yes, oh yes, we got it. We got it. Oh, and we got it. Get it out the water. Oh, we got it. We got it. Grab the rod quickly for us, cameraman. We got it. We got it. Oh, would you look at that? We caught ourselves this elusive black marlin. After all that effort stalking it, after a thousand throws and many days on the water, look what we've caught. Oh, it's a keeper. Hi guys, welcome to another episode of Catch Cook. As you can see, my black marlin, uh, aka Molly, primal provider in the making. She's now having a little sleep. She's tired after work and her, her daily acting for the video. Well done, my baby. You've done a good job today. Yeah, the Catch Cook we're doing is fishing for the black marlin, as we call it, or black Labrador. But to be honest, we're actually going to be using some kudu that we shot last year, at the end of last year, so it's still nice and fresh. I hope you enjoyed the little intro where we had a throw here while we're in quarantine, keeping ourselves busy. What we've got here, we've got some kudu in the packet, which I'm just going to cut up into blocks shortly. And I've just got some olive oil in the, in the pan here, or in the pot. And we're going to be making a kudu stew. I've got some onion cut up, which I want to chuck in the pan. And then we're going to crush three cl uh, cloves of garlic to start it off and put some Italian herbs in. Yeah, viewers, as you know, I do tend to do a lot of those uh, longer videos that are ex uh, exceeding 10, 15 minutes. But um, this is just a little short one to inform you on how we're going to be operating during the season that we're in now. Um, and just one to bring a bit of humor to the, the tough times and the sad times where everyone's feeling a bit down and worried. Who's trying to bring a smile to your face, yeah? So we're not going to show you everything that we do in this too, but as we go, I'm going to just give you the ingredients. It's a nice short little video just to add to your day. But nevertheless, we're still in full operation and we're there for you guys. We're there to answer any questions you got and keep you company and keep you busy during 21 days of um, boredom and sitting at home. Okay, we've got our kudu cut up and inside here. Next step is to just add a bit of salt and pepper onto this just to um, salt up the meat a bit, get some flavor. I'm using a tongs because um, spatula is feeding a little bit flimsy under the weight of the meat. But that's it going inside there, simple. Onion, three cloves of garlic, some Italian herbs, olive oil, and the meat. Let the meat cook up a bit. And the next step is your Nando's Peri Peri lemon and herb sauce. Extra mild. Adding the sauce in now. I'm adding half a bottle. And we've turned our heat down to be a slow cook. And the sauce also does have a bit of garlic in. So if you think you've added too little garlic, it's enough. Because the sauce has garlic in it. Just mix it up and let it slow cook. And then just now we'll add some water and mazina. Put the lid on and uh, we'll let it cook away. And viewers, the merch, 
You can still buy your merch while we're in lockdown. The store is running uh, 100%. All the, the guys at the office are working from home, but the store is still available. So if you're looking for merch, now's the time while you do nothing, you can go have a look on, on the store and order. And when the lockdown's over, it will be delivered to you. We've added our potato, added a bit of chicken stock to this. Yes, I know it's kudu, but the chicken stock gives a good flavor. Some Cajun spice, salt, pepper, a bit of water and some corn flour. Just thicken it up. It's just sitting here simmering. I'm going to put the lid on, leave it go for a bit more and uh, almost ready to serve. Got Granny Nana here, dishing up some rice for us. Famous here on YouTube, eh? A couple thousand people are gonna see the sexy granny of mine. Jen, she's single. Come down. Next one. Dishing it up with some whole wheat low GR bread, some rice cooked by my gran, and then we got the stew that side. Oh, the flavors here is making my tongue dance with excitement. Mm -hmm. To all the viewers, from Molly, my partner in crime and myself, thanks for joining us today and for watching another episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe guys and just stay safe in these times, stay home, just follow all the rules and regulations put out by the government as this is more serious than a lot of people think. But just stay safe, keep supporting us, um, and keep in tune for all of our tackle talks coming up, as well as our um, little recipe blogs we're going to be putting out. And um, we'll catch you on the other end of the, the lockdown. We have 35,000 of you subscribers out there that are watching our channel on a daily basis. Now, what we're appealing to you guys for is likes, comments, and shares. We have uh, quite a few of our primal providers in lockdown on farms, uh, myself with a dam in my in my backyard and we're able to punch out some some content for you guys to keep you entertained in this lockdown period if you guys would like to see that content we want to see you guys liking commenting and sharing on all our videos if we see the likes the comments and the shares start increasing we're going to punch out a video every single day to keep you guys entertained it's easy guys it takes five seconds get on the bottom of the video Hit the share button and share it on all your platforms. If we get 20,000 likes on our videos, we will release one video every day of this lockdown. So get liking, guys. Get sharing and get liking. Guys, I look forward to uh, seeing some shares and making some content for you guys.